morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Friday, TGIF. Say good morning, Callie. It's 8.30 right now, and I'm going to make some breakfast. So we're gonna have oatmeal this today. This today, we're gonna have oatmeal today. And then I was gonna um, toast up a slice of bread, but then I remembered we had biscuits, so I was like, I really wanna try these biscuits. We bought these a few weeks ago, actually. They're, they're frozen buttermilk biscuits. Somebody recommended me these frozen biscuits, so we're gonna try them. Um, it says, heat oven to 375, place frozen biscuits, sides touching on ungreased cookie sheet. Biscuit sides should touch for higher rising. So let's give this a try. I wish this had, a, I, did, I wish it came in a resealable bag, but I'll just put it in a Ziploc. How do you separate the ones that are stuck together? I have no idea. How many should I make? Maybe we'll make like six, so everybody can have some. See like how, there you go. That's really scary what I'm doing, I know. Okay, I got that separated. Don't do what I did, it's dangerous. <laughs> Okay, so then one to six biscuits bakes for 22 to 26 minutes. And then I'm gonna put this, like the whole bag, I'm gonna put it in a freezer bag. We're just gonna eat oatmeal for now. Last night we watched Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 and it was a very good movie. I highly recommend it. There's lots of crying. It's Kind of sad, but um, it was a really good movie. I'm really sad though that it's the last Guardians movie. Like I didn't even know this was gonna be their last movie, AJ told me, and I was like, what, why, oh my God. But it was a really good movie and we all cried a lot. I have my oatmeal here. I'm gonna let it cool for a little bit and then I'm gonna add in a banana and now we're gonna make some coffee. I think it's weird, it's so weird that they say new on the bottle, but they literally had this last year. <sighs> so good, you guys. Okay, so I'll show you guys the biscuits when they come out. And yeah, that's it, I'll show, I'll show you guys the biscuits when they come out of the oven. Let's take a look at these biscuits. Ooh, look at that, 22 minutes. I got my biscuit right here. I split it in half. I like my biscuits with strawberry jam, well any kind of jam or jelly. But this is what we have. This is how I like to eat it. How do you guys like to eat your biscuits? Honey, butter, jam or jelly? These are good. These are definitely better than the canned biscuits. What do you think, Papa? What? You think these are better than the canned biscuits? Yeah, yeah these are good. She's getting her nails clipped. <laughs> oh, she's getting bored. She's doing good. That's right, folks. We are live here at Petco. Yeah, right now, Callie's getting her nails trimmed. Uh, 
<laughs> did you say you're live from Petco? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, what is he saying? Live from Petco. Oh, okay, job. guys. We just took Callie to Petco to have her nails trimmed. They <laughs> trim and buff. And we were talking, because you know, like the last time we got Callie's haircut, they cut it really short. And we just found out that Callie has a double coat and you're not supposed to use clippers, which the groomer never said anything to us. And I don't know anything. We don't know anything about the double coat. And, yeah. you know, you would think that they would say, hey, we don't want to go too short. Um, you're she's only a double supposed to use scissors. Dog, like, yeah. Um, they were tell the guy at Petco was saying like they never use clippers on double coats and that her double coat might not grow back or it might grow weird or poor Callie and he said it's dangerous because they could overheat and stuff okay. so I'm like I'm really upset at the groomer we're not gonna take her there anymore this was the worst haircut she ever got actually this really short one she said she cut it too short she was like oh I think I accidentally cut it too short what what do you mean you accidentally cut it too short? Yeah. And they never even educated us on the double coat. My dog before doesn't, she didn't have a double coat, so I didn't yeah, know. Guys, so you guys getting a dog or you have a dog right now and it's young and you want to get it trimmed, only, or, you know, uh, haircut, Let's take don't haircut. use, uh, don't make use sure the they don't clippers. use clippers because if it's double coated, you don't want to, you know, mess with the dog's coat. Poor Callie. Why did they do that to you? <sighs> We're gonna call them and let them know you <laughs> messed up my dog's fur. You messed up my fur. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Callie. The next day. All right, guys. So me and Callie are at this park. Um, it's called Anderson Park. It's in Rialto. Back here they have this like obstacle course. We'll show you guys when we get there. All right, guys. So we're here. And this has basically, they got a big dog side and then they got the little dog side. <laughs> We're all friends. It's okay. So you got all that. And then you got like, um, see, there's a big dog right there. Like a little... <laughs> hey. So yeah. Okay. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. We went on the big dog side because the other people are still on the small dog side. And plus, I wanted Callie to try these stairs. Come on, Callie. Come on. Over here. Come on. Up these stairs. Up, 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 up. Come on. Up here. Up. Callie. Come on. No. This way. Up. Up. Come on. Come on. Up these stairs. Come on, Callie, over here. Come on. <laughs> Come on, go, go up. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go up. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Come on, let's go, go. Come on, up here. Oh my God, <laughs> she doesn't want to do it, guys. Come on. Come on, Callie. Callie, come this way. Come. Go. Go to jump through. Go. <laughs> come on. Come through the tire. Come on. Come on. She just likes to smell. All right, guys, let's try it with the leash. Come on, Callie. Come on. No, up here. Up here. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Callie. Callie. Hold on. Let's see. Come on. Let's go. Ready? Up, 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 up. Let's go. Up. Up. Come on. Come on. See? Okay, now let's go down. Come on. There you go. Let's try it again. Come on. Up. Come on. Up. Let's go. Up. Up. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Good girl. Go. Go across. Come on. Come on. 
Yay! Let's go through here. She's like, what is this, Daddy? I've never been to a park like this. <laughs> 2,000 years later. Bye, Callie. You're going to go on a walk? <laughs> Early morning walk? Yay. Okay, bye. bye. Have fun. Bye. Go. Bye. There they go. Bye, Callie. She's too focused. <laughs> okay. Hi guys. Good morning, Bumblebeezies. Good morning. Good morning. Happy, Happy Sunday. Sunday. We're going grocery shopping at Winco. Where else would we be going, right? Yeah, exactly. Um, after this, we're gonna go to Costco. We don't have that many things to buy, but yeah, short list. Have you guys tried these before? I think it's kind of like a Rice Krispie treat, but this is made with Lucky Charms. They also have a cinnamon toast crunch and then a Reese's puffs. I'm interested. This is the ranch that we like to use, the homestyle ranch. They have it at Sam's Club. It's a big jar or a big bottle for only like actually a dollar more. So this is $3.98 here and I believe it's $4.98 at Sam's. The only thing is we can't go through it quick enough. So we just buy the small ones here and we're gonna try this one today, Hatch Chili. We haven't tried that one yet. Um, there's a jalapeno ranch that we like too. Oh, this one. That's, that one's good. And their blue cheese is really good. If you like, if you like blue cheese, it's really good. We're all done with Winco. Now we're at Costco. Costco. It's very convenient because it's right across the street from Winco. All right, guys, let's go. Look at this, you guys. They have confetti cookies. Should we try it? Yeah, yeah let's try it. This one is new too, I think. Lemonberry Lemon blueberry. blueberry loaf. I put together three baskets for our diaper raffle. We're gonna have three winners. Um, I was originally only gonna do one basket, like one winner, but we have a lot of people coming and hopefully a lot of people join the diaper raffle. So I thought, you know what, let me do more prizes. So we're doing three prizes. This is just one of them. They all have different themes. This one is a barbecue theme. So this one comes with a cutting board, these smoking wood chips. Um, what else is in here? There's another wood chip. Yeah, there's two wood chips, this smoke box. I got these um, like squeeze tubes for sauces. I got that at Marshall's. This barbecue kit actually is from Sam's Club. So it came with like the cutting board and all this like barbecue stuff. You have some tongs. And there's two jars of barbecue sauce, this Kansas City one and then a St. Louis one. And then I just added two bags of chips. And the basket is also from Marshall's and then I'm gonna put it in a plastic. So I'll show you guys the other ones and I'll show you guys how they look with the plastic. The other baskets are already done. This one is a spa theme. So we have like face masks, body scrubs. There's a candle. There is one of those like headbands you wear when you're like washing your face or doing your makeup. There's a wet brush. I put a bottle of um, Stella in there. Is that what's called Stella? I think it's pineapple flavor. There's some chapstick. There's a lip mask. So just like all relaxation things. Oh, and this is like bath fizzers over there. So that's, I thought that was nice. And then this one is a breakfast theme. So this one, this Hamilton Beach, this is a breakfast sandwich maker. I don't know if you can see it, but it's one of those like machines where you could make like your own Egg McMuffin at home. And then I went to Trader Joe's and I got their mini chocolate chip pancake and waffle mix. Also the Ube Mochi mix. There's a mug in there. Also a Starbucks tumbler. This is like tea bags from Trader Joe's. And then there's also some maple syrup in there. I just put the basket in the cellophane bag. I got the bags from Amazon. But this one is really, this one, because this basket is bigger than the other baskets, so it doesn't fit this, like, upright. So I have to put the bag sideways, which I think is fine. I'm going to put the bow on the end. But I want to show you guys the bows that I got. I also found these on Amazon. It, they can't, this came with 50 bows, you guys, but it was so inexpensive. So I was like, I, I didn't mind, you know, having extras. We can use them for Christmas or other gifts. But they're so cool. I've never seen this before. So basically, on this end, if you, like... It's split, so if you open it up, there's two strings inside. See the two strings right there? You just pull them, and then this literally will form into a bow. So. Oh, 
It's so cool. You just literally just pull the string and then you have a bow. Isn't that so cool? And then I like to just tie a knot here just to make sure it stays down. But I feel like it's pretty, it's pretty secure already. But yeah, we're gonna tie a knot just to make sure it doesn't come undone. And then it's cool because the strings that it comes with, you just use this to tie around your gift. So I tie this around the plastic. So here's how I wrapped this larger basket. I just put it in sideways and put the bow on the side. I'm here with Callie, we're in the car. Papa Bear went to um, Yum Yum to get me a donut. I was like, I really want a donut. There's another place that we go to, it's called Mana. It's just like a little mom and pop donut shop. They have really good donuts, but they close early. Yum Yum is open 24 hours. They're good too, but like, you know, <laughs> Mana is better. Sorry about that, guys. Papa Bear was actually FaceTiming me from inside. Callie. Callie. But yeah, anyways, I was just saying that we're at Yum Yum Donuts. Because <laughs> I wanted a twist donut. And Callie's back there. Say hi, Callie. 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 Callie loves to go bye-bye. Anytime you say go bye bye, she's ready to go. We're back home. This is what I wanted you guys the tiger tail. So good. Normally I get the um the crumb crumb twist or a crumb donut, but today I was like, nope, I'm gonna I want the tiger tail. Callie, it's dinner time. Say hi. Say I'm waiting for my dinner. So anyways, we are making dinner right now. We're having bacon cheeseburgers. So we have three of them already ready. We got some bacon right here. I have more patties cooking, and then we also have seasoned fries. Um, they're already at the table. Then we have onions and lettuce. Nobody wanted tomato except for me, but I was like, I'm not gonna cut a whole tomato just for me. So no tomato, that's fine. So you guys know how I have a lot of nail polish. Well. I actually just got another nail polish rack. It's not the exact same one as the one that I already have. I tried to get the same one, but they don't have it anymore. So I got, you know, just another one. I mean, they look exactly the same, but up close you can tell they're not the exact same, which it's fine, it doesn't bother me or anything. But I'm going to put all of my new nail polish on here. I don't think it's not gonna be like full, but it's just nice to have more space now for my, all of my nail polish. So these are all the boxes of nail polish that I need to put away. I was going to hang them up there or I was going to put them on there right now. But I was like, you know what, let me wait um, just so we can make sure that the um, command strips are like holding on to the nail polish rack really well before we put the nail polishes. Mm -hmm. 